This is the Timber Cruisers Outpost. What different activities are in this outpost? We have a number of activities. We have a rope climb, a stump joust, a log hoist, a log saw, or two-man log saw. We have some primitive woodworking. And then on the very end, we have our caber toss and our chip toss. What do the boys get out of attending this outpost? They get a number of things. Uh, a lot of these things test uh, physical abilities uh, with the caber toss, the chip toss, the rope climb. Those are physical things. The stump joust is a nice team one for them to have fun and enjoy one another and uh, uh, kind of build some teamwork together on it. Uh, the woodworking is a fun thing for them to, to see how primitive things they can just build some, some fun things with that. Um, and then the log hoist takes a lot of teamwork. They've got to know their knots. They've got to be able to work together as a team. They've got to have a good captain that can direct the boys to do the different knots. Um, it takes a bit. Of, it takes a good team to get through that one in a decent time. Okay, Al, last question. How many man hours should an ADC plan on spending to prepare this outpost? <laughs> that is a good question. Um, assuming they already have the materials that we've put together, um, gathering the materials is a certain amount of time. Uh, actually assembling things here, um, if you show up Thursday afternoon or Wednesday afternoon, uh, two o'clock, uh, you can you've got some time between two and five to do some setup. As long as you've got five to ten guys helping, and then the rest you can kind of finalize Thursday morning. So, okay.